Welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to set up C Sharp in Visual Studio Code on Windows operating system by following its official documentation. So let's get started. At first, install Visual Studio Code on your system. If you don't have installed Visual Studio Code on your system, install it from Microsoft Store. Source for Visual Studio Code, select and click on this install button. It may take a while for installing Visual Studio Code. Visual Studio Code installed successfully. Let's verify the installation. That's it. Now install C Sharp Dev Kit extension. So click on this link and then click on install button open visual studio code click on the install button to install this extension developed by microsoft it may take a while for installing that's it c sharp dev kit extension installed successfully on visual studio code for dotnet development you must install dotnet sdk check that whether you install dotnet sdk on your system or not using this command on common prompt dotnet hyphen hyphen version i already have installed the latest version of dotnet sdk now I am going to show you how to install .NET SDK on Windows operating system. Open your favorite web browser. Browse this URL .NET.Microsoft.com. Click on the Downloads button. Now I am going to download .NET for Windows operating system. So select the .NET version. This is the standard term support and it is recommended. So click on this link to download .NET SDK for Windows 64-bit operating system. It may take a while for downloading. After a successful download, go into the downloads folder and run this installer. So open and click on this install button. If you asked a question from user account control, do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device, select yes. It may take a while for installing. That's it. Microsoft .NET SDK 9 installed successfully and let's verify the installation. Open command prompt and write this command here .NET hyphen hyphen version. That's it. .NET SDK installed successfully. Now I'm going to create a .NET project. So click on the view and then select command palette now type dot net new and select dot net new project working with c sharp dev kit sign in to your visual studio subscription You can sign in with GitHub account. Select this option, authorize Microsoft Corporation. Now link your GitHub credentials to your Microsoft account. Click on next. A 
if you see this you are signed in now and can close this page then you can close this now click on the view or press ctrl shift p at the same time and then type dot net clone new project and select this now select the templates from this drop down list i am going to create a console application so i am going to select this now select a folder where do you want to store this application. I am going to store this application into my desktop. So create a new folder and I am going to name it my .NET projects. Select this folder and now enter the project name. I'm going to name it first app now press enter to confirm your input or escape to cancel the project will be created in this location so select the option create project now trust the authors expand the application and open programs.cs file now i am going to run this application so go to the top right corner of the editor and click on this drop down icon and select this option run project associated with this file that's it now i am going to modify this and run again don't select the code runner run button select this run button to run a project that's it if you are uh, new to this channel subscribe this channel and like comment share thank you so much for watching this tutorial